guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day today. I am finally, and I mean finally, happy to say that I can film my Nordstrom Anniversary Sale haul. The Nordstrom Anniversary Sale has been going on for a few weeks now. You might have checked out my wish list, also vlog, but as you know, sometimes things can take a little bit to ship and I placed a bunch of orders and I wanted to make sure that I had everything in before I did a haul. So like usual, if you're interested in anything I share, I will be sure to link everything down below. The sale ends on August 6th, so you do still have about two weeks or so from today's date. Today is the 26th, so you do have, um, still have a little bit of time to shop. So hopefully if there's anything else you have been eyeing, you'll be able to pick it up. I have about... 16 items to share. I have something from Tiffany & Co. I have something from Burberry. I have something from, what else? Dior Beauty. I have a bunch of things. Hermes Beauty. So many fun things. Some clothing items. I also, another thing I wanted to share too, and I will save this for the end. This wasn't part of the sale, but I did also pick up something from Valentino that I wanted to share as well. So this is going to be a long video, so let's go ahead and get into it. I have 16 things to share. Let's get into it. Okay, I am going to try to group these items together. The first item that I wanna share is a pair of shoes. And if you saw my wish list video, these will come as no surprise. And it is a pair of Nike Air Max. And I thought these were so pretty. As you can see, they are blue and pink and white. I love Nike Air Max sneakers. They are so comfortable. And I thought I would use these for athleisure. And one of the main reasons I got them is I thought the pink would go with some of my pink Chanel bags, specifically my Chanel Deauville. Now this pink looks a little more like a baby pink. I think my Deauville is a little more lavender undertones. I will insert a clip. So hopefully it matches, hopefully it works. But I ordered these in an eight and a half and they were on sale for $74.99, which I thought was a good deal. There were also a pair of New Balance sneakers I really, really wanted, but by the time it was my turn to shop, which I'm sure a lot of you can relate, I'm influencer level, so there are still two levels ahead of me. A lot of the items I wanted were sold out. Specifically, I wanted the Longchamp Le Pliage crossbody tote. I, I had ordered that, but then they canceled my order. And when I went into store, they actually had two of them, but I didn't pick them up because I had already placed an order and then they canceled the order. So it was, you know, long story, but it's okay. I didn't need another handbag anyway, but I was happy to pick up these shoes. Super, super cute. And I think they're gonna look great with athleisure wear just kind of running around town. The next item I wanna share, it's a little too hot to talk about this now, but as you know, in the Nordstrom sale, it's a good time to pick up fall items. And I saw this sweater and it immediately spoke to me because I love bright colors. It is by Vera Moda. And as you can tell, it's not for everybody. It's super, super bright, but it has these pinks and these neon colors. It is so pretty. I got it in a size small. You might recall from my vlog, I did try it on. I had a dress on when I tried it on, but um, it fit. I think I think this is gonna look really, really nice in the upcoming fall months with a nice pair of jeans. I have yet to find like a pair of trendy jeans that suit me well. So if you guys are like me and you have a little bit of a booty, let me know what your favorite jeans are. I love frame jeans, but I didn't actually pick up any in the sale this year because I have a pair of frame jeans that I own. I have like two or three pairs and I just love them, but they are skinny jeans. And I know they say skinny jeans are out of style, but I don't care. I'm still gonna wear them because I like them. But I thought they would pair nicely with this sweater. Super, super cute. Love the bright colors. Again, this was on sale for $55.99. Let's talk about an item that I pick up every year during the sale. I have multiple colors and I have a couple in the same color as well. And it is these Zella joggers. I love these. I live in these in the fall months. I work from home and these are just so comfortable. Plus, I feel like joggers are nice because even though they're casual and comfy, you can 
you know, kind of dress them up a little bit as well. But these are nice because they have a little drawstring. And then because of the material, it's just super lightweight and comfortable. So I do have a pair that I own, but those are, I have worn them to the ground. So I needed to get a new one. I got a size medium and I love these. They also had them in like a grayish blue that was really pretty as well. But I opted for the black again because I love it. But I pick these up every year and these are on sale for $42.99. And after this sale, they go back to $60. So if you're looking for a good pair of joggers, definitely consider checking out the Zella Live-In Pocket Joggers. Love them. They are my favorite and I recommend them to you guys every year. I picked up another sweater and this is by Topshop and this was on sale for $39.99 and I got it in a beautiful green color. It's something about this color green. I actually am wearing a green dress today. I got it from Target in case you're interested. But this sweater, once again, I thought I could wear with my skinny jeans. And again, I will branch out. Like I said, I welcome your advice and your opinions on jeans if you found some that you love, but I just don't know that I could pull off the new style. But I love this color sweater. It also came in pink. That was part of my wish list as well. But it was something about this green that just drew me in. I thought it was so pretty. You know me, I love pops of color. But this is oversized. I did um, order this in a size small, but I just, uh, I love it. And I thought it was a good price for a sweater as well. $39.99, great, great deal. And again, comes in other colors as well. Forgive me, that sweater was $49.99. The next one I'm about to talk about was $39.99, and it is this one right here. This is by Treasure and Bond, and I really wanted to get a good neutral sweater that I could wear with a lot of my bags, and I thought this really pretty creamy white color was nice. The only thing I worry about when I'm looking at it right here, I can see through it, so hopefully when I'm trying it on, it's not see-through, but this is $39.99. Once again, I thought it would look nice with a pair of jeans and boots, and I love that you could really change the look of it by what handbag you wear. Like you could be a little more neutral, wear black, and you can also wear a pop of color as well. So I'm excited about this. It's a turtleneck slash kind of like a little bit of like a cow neck a little bit, but I really liked the white color. Like I said, I did want to invest in some more neutrals, but this one was $39.99 and this one was $49.99. All right, so that's it for the shoes slash clothes. Let's move now to the beauty category because they always have some really good beauty items. And the first item I picked up is something I recommend every year. I cannot live without this. That sounds a little dramatic, but with my makeup routine, I can't live without it. And I definitely notice a difference in my makeup if I'm not using it. It's the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base Duo. So this is a good time to buy this because you get two for the price of one. This is $66, but typically, one of these is around $60. So the good thing about this is it's a moisturizer that doubles as a, as a primer. So you can either use it alone or you can use it with another primer. It's up to you. I will usually use this as a moisturizer in the morning. Then I will put, uh, I like my Tarte primer as well. But this has a really, really like thick consistency and I'll show you right here. It has a really thick consistency, but I love it. I've actually gotten a couple of my friends turned on to it as well. It's so good. And as I stated, if it's if it's something you wanted to try, I definitely recommend picking it up with the anniversary sale because you get two for basically the price of one. This is such a good little deal. It's already an expensive moisturizer and I remember when I first bought it, I'm like, "Oh my god, I'm paying so much for a moisturizer." But Trust me when I say that it's worth it and I definitely notice a difference when I don't use it. Okay, the next beauty item I picked up retails for $99, but I thought this was great because you could actually gift it to somebody or it would be good to try out different fragrances from Hermes. And it is the Collection Parfums Jardines. Hopefully I am pronouncing that correctly, but they had a little tester set up where you could smell all of the fragrances and every single one of these smelled so good. They were really, really nice. And I'm not gonna open it, so I will insert a picture of what's in it because I haven't decided if I'm going to keep it for myself or if I'm going to gift it. But that you can see what comes in here. So this would be great for your purse. But again, 
They all smell so nice, and who wouldn't love to get this little orange box as a special gift? So as I stated, I don't want to open it yet because I'm still undecided if I'm going to keep it or if I'm going to gift it to somebody, so we'll see. But either way, $99, and you get to test out four of the fragrances. I do own one of them. I actually picked it up when I was in Vegas. I think it's the Jardin de Monsor Lee. I hope I'm saying that right. Um, I do own that one from Vegas, but all the others I don't own. So I'm super excited about either keeping this or gifting this to somebody. Okay, now I have a couple items from Dior Beauty to share. You know how much I love Dior Beauty, but I have to tell you, if you guys haven't checked out A Heated Mess or Cindy's channel, you definitely need to do so because she always gives the best recommendation when it comes to sales associates or free gifts with purchase and in her video she shared that she got like one of the best free gifts with purchase and I will share that with you after I share these items but her sales associate is at Nordstrom is Marae and she is super super sweet so I reached out to her and I actually purchased these items through her and that way I got free gifts if you buy online you can get free gifts with purchase but sometimes if you go through a sales associate there'll be like special promotions like there was a Dior lanyard she was out of of, but I ended up getting a Dior notebook and she only had one left and that's what I saw on Cindy's channel. I was like, oh, I want to have that notebook. So make sure to check out Marae on Instagram. She was super, super nice. She was a pleasure to deal with. She was very quick to get back to me and she was able to get me these free gifts. So let me share with you the Dior items first and then I'll share with you the free gifts. So the first item I picked up here and this is a great gift for you or you know, someone in your life, it'd also be good for travel. It is the Dior Capture Total set. And so it is $165, but it's a $237 value. You get a little pouch, you get the serum, you get the Intensive Essence Lotion, you get the eye serum, and then you get the firming and wrinkle correcting cream. This is a great little gift. I also think this would be great for travel as well. I am traveling soon. We're going on a vacation with my family, so I think this would be great to take with me. So this was the first thing I got from Dior. It's a great little set. And then the next item I got from Dior, and this is another really good little set. It is the Dior Beauty set here. So you get the little pink pouch, you get the lip glow, you get a Dior show, and then you get the um, primer as well. So, so cute. Absolutely love the pouch. $62 for all of this. And then I'll share with you the last Dior item, and then I'll share with you all the free gifts I got. Okay, the next item is here, and this is the Dior Prestige Display. Discovery set. It's a $398 value for $297. You get the Dior Prestige. This is the exfoliating polishing scrub mask. Then you get the Dior Prestige Advanced Serum. Then you get this little guy right here, which is the Rose Advanced Serum. I love this stuff so good. And then the final item you get is the Dior Prestige La Creme. So you get all of this, which I think is a great, great deal. And now let me share with you. So getting these three Dior items that were gifts with purchase and, and Marae really hooked me up. Okay, so I have a box here. The first gift, gift with purchase I got was this little black pouch. And on the inside of the pouch, I got a little Dior um, Maximizer 3D. I also got a little Dior Show. And then I got a little um, Dior Attic lip, lip Maximizer. So this was the first gift of purchase. Then I got this cute little white Dior bag. I know I don't need any more Dior bags, but I'm such a sucker for these. And on the inside, you also got Dior Prestige and the uh, La Creme and then the Concentrate. I got two of these, which is amazing. And then she also gave me one of these little guys. Um, you get the two little lipsticks. So let me show you what that looks like. So it comes in a little box like this. You open it and you get two little uh, velvet lipsticks. 100 and 999. 999 is their red. That's what they're known for. And then 100 is more of a nude shade. So this was a free gift. And then this is why I contacted her. If you spent a certain amount, you ended up getting this 
Dior notebook with the oblique print. I was so excited. So you open it, it's the little things. It's just blank, so it doesn't say Dior on the pages inside, but I still really loved the Dior oblique. So definitely reach out to her. I'll put her information down below, and I wanna give another special shout out to Cindy. Thank you again for recommending her. I love getting all these free gifts with purchase. And if you know you're gonna buy something anyway, it's nice to get the free gifts with purchase. So just an FYI, you know how much I love my free gifts. We are still going, we have more to share. The next item, let's move to jewelry. And I'm so excited about this. You may or may not know how much I love Kendra Scott. And this Kendra Scott is the Layla Stud in fuchsia magnesite. I thought these were so, so cute. These are normally $65, but they were on sale for $39.99, and look at that color. And again, if the camera's washing it out, I will be sure to insert an overlay, but these are so, so pretty. I had to have these. So this was the first one. Hey, I have another jewelry item. Once again, uh, Kendra Scott, these are so pretty. It's the same color as the others. These are the uh, Layla Drop. They're $44.99 and it's gonna go back to $70. So these are so, so pretty. Actually, um, these kind of go, oh, it's a little off actually. But the, this like pink is so pretty and I'm so sorry, the camera is like really washing it out, but I will insert an overlay, but these are so pretty. I love Kendra Scott earrings. So anytime I can get them on sale, I definitely, you know, run. And then I have one more jewelry item and this is another Kendra Scott. And I had gotten those studs and you know how much I love turquoise. I initially wasn't gonna get the turquoise, but look how pretty these are. I couldn't resist. I saw them in store, again, $39.99. These are so beautiful. You can never have enough turquoise jewelry. And fun fact, I've been a fan of Kendra Scott for years. I mean, 10, 15 years, however long. And their turquoise jewelry is what actually first turned me onto it. I remember seeing a newscaster wear them and I was like, what are those earrings? And she happened to mention it. I'm like, oh my God. So then I went to the website and I have been hooked ever since. I just love them. They're to die for. So I picked up these as well. So three pairs of Kendra Scott earrings. Did I need to buy three pairs? No, I definitely didn't, but it was such a good deal. Too good to resist. Okay, moving right along, let's talk sunglasses. I have two pairs of sunglasses to share, which did I need to buy two pairs? No, I didn't, but you guys, they had some really good sunglasses that were on sale, and the ones I got you might be a little surprised. I'm not sure, I can't remember if I included these in my wish list. Maybe I did, but, but the first are by Burberry, and these are really cute. So you get the little Burberry case, so for 169, they're basic black um, square sunglasses, but they have the Burberry detail on the side. So I will try them on so you can see. Actually, let me look this way. So see that cool little detail? I love that. It might be a little much, but I thought I could wear these when I wear my, my Burberry bag, but I just loved that Burberry print on the side. So again, on sale, um, 169. Did I need another pair of black sunnies? No, I didn't, but I just, I saw these when I was in store and I just thought they were so, so cute. I really loved that detail and I don't have anything like that. So plus I love the little like case that you get, the whole shebang. And the next pair I got, it's Tiffany & Company. You might be surprised by these as well, but I really, really wanted these as soon as I saw them. So of course the beautiful Tiffany box, the beautiful Tiffany um, sunglass case. These were a little more expensive. They were $2.93, which I think is so expensive for sunglasses, but if you think of the fact that they're Tiffany & Company, I was okay with it. And these are beautiful. So these are, Tiffany & Company gradient sunglasses, so they have a silver frame, but then the cool thing on the side where you see the Tiffany T, it does have some rhinestones, and then you have the Tiffany blue here, so they are square, so I do have some large sunglasses like this, but they have a gold frame, and these are silver, so, so cute, so let me turn this way so you can see what they look like, but I just really loved the look of them. They were so different. Now, the only thing I kind of wish, I do wish there was some sort of like a Tiffany blue on the tee, but 
needless to say, I love these. And then, you know, the, the Tiffany box and the Tiffany sunglass holder. So these were probably my biggest splurge during the sale. But again, now is a good time to stock up on sunglasses or things like that that go on sale. They did also have a pair of Celine sunglasses that I was really interested in, but I already have a very similar pair of black sunglasses, so I thought, no, I'm not gonna get these. But as you can tell, these are unique. I like the rhinestones as well. So, you guys, that is everything I picked up from the sale. Now I have one more item to share. I got this item from Nordstrom as well, so I thought this would be a good video to share it in. And it is actually by Valentino. I'm sure you can tell it is a pair of shoes. And if you have followed my videos and watched me, I'm sure you know what shoes these are. Uh, it's my first pair of Valentino shoes. And I think I mentioned in a video, well, let me just show you first. So you get the little Valentino dust bag. And the shoes I got are the Valentino Rockstead Thong sandals. So these, they come in either like a jelly or they come in a leather. So I opted for the jelly. The leather is obviously a lot more expensive and the jelly, I feel like I'm not going to be as nervous about like ruining, whereas the leather are more expensive and I'd worry I would ruin them, but you get the same look. I was torn between these or the gladiator style, but I opted for these because I thought these would be easy to put on and off. And the main reason I wanted to get these is because I thought they would pair so nicely with my YSL Raffia camera bag. So I struggled to find shoes to match that bag. I do have a pair of like Steve Madden shoes similar to this, but they have the silver rock stud. So it kind of clashes a little bit. I also do have some Tory Burch slides that work, but I really wanted to invest in a good pair because in the summer months I wear that bag all the time, all the time. So I was so happy to find this in my size. I don't think they have a lot of sizes left, but they have a ton of other colors. So I'll link this one and I'll also link the leather pair as well. And I'll also link the Gladiator sandals as well. But I was so happy to get these. Again, I am one of those type of people where I like to match my shoes to my handbags. And I feel like I wear my handbags a lot more if I know that I have a go-to pair of shoes that match. I know not a lot of people do that. Um, sometimes they think that's too matchy-matchy, but that's what I like to do. And I'm so excited to own these. I also did a poll and asked a bunch of people if these were comfortable. And most people that own them said they were. I also saw the cute little flip-flop with like the little bow on it. I considered that as well. But when I saw they had these available, I just went for it and I'm so happy I did. So yeah, hopefully this video wasn't too long, but let me know what was your favorite item that I picked up. I think I got some really, really good items. I'm so excited about my free gifts with purchase. Make sure to check out Marae. I will link her Instagram uh, down below. I have a couple new sweaters. I didn't go overboard. I have some new sunglasses, new fragrances, new shoes. I think I got a good variety without going too overboard. So like you Usual, I will link everything down below. Hopefully a lot of these items are still available. I will also put some other items that were on my radar that I just didn't pick up for whatever reason. So check the description and everything will be down there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, I would love to have you hit that little subscribe button and I would love to have you follow me on Instagram as well. Have a wonderful day you guys and I'll see you in my next video.